Nil, uh, five nil, disappointing to say the least. How do you sum up today's performance? Um, I sum it up by saying that uh, it was a diabolical performance. Um, it sums up the season. Um, it shows how much work there is to do to get the club and to get the team um, onto a you know to a level and to a consistency uh, that we need to be competing in this league and uh, matured up everything that's wrong um, with the team today. I knew before the game it wasn't going to be our um, best team that we were putting out and certainly the performance reflected that but having said that the thing that hurts me the most is the lack of fight, the lack of uh, determination. Um, you can sometimes accept if players are better, better than yourself or if the team's better, but not for a lack of um, effort and commitment, which you'd have to say was evident today. And it's, it's, um, we have to work hard. I know we have to work hard to bring in players and uh, we've got to be able to come here next season with a better team and to be playing much better than we've done today and to give the supporters who come a team that's worthy of, of playing for the shirt. Um, you've been handing the younger players uh, starts over the last few games. Harry Benz became the first player for Port Vale, born after the Millennium, to feature in a league game. Um, what did you make of his performance today? There was no criticism to any of the younger players because, to be perfectly honest, you shouldn't have to be coming onto a game, uh, you know, when it's when you're four 0 down or whatever it was when it came on because very difficult. I mean, in one in one respect, there's no pressure on you, but um, you should be coming onto a pitch where you've got your teammates can help you and where they can teach you, where they can learn you the ropes. But um, I'm pleased with Harry because, like I say, he got thrown on, he kept the ball. He, he you know, I absolve any of the younger lads from criticism. It was a difficult game for him to come on, but it'll be great for his confidence that he's he's made his debut. Um, you've summed it up really already, a disappointing game, disappointing season as a whole, but what would be your message to the fans now to summarise the season and to look ahead to next season? Well, it'll, you know, everybody's going to be hurting tonight, myself included, but we've got to forget this season. We, it's be, it hasn't been good enough, it's been you know, really bad for the supporters, I accept that. Um, but we have to go back to the fact that you know we the job was to stay up, which we've done. Um, it showed today that um, those games where we've scrapped and where we've fought and where we've done all the things needed, you know, those displays have been the ones that have kept us up and got us the points and got us over the line. And today showed that um, if you don't get 11 players willing to to battle for the cause, regardless of what what you've got on the pitch, you're not going to win games. And uh, there is, you know, it, it is so disappointing. It's very hard to speak after games when you've you've witnessed that. It's been like a torture, some of the games. And I know it is for the supporters, but believe you, it's it's bad for me on the sidelines because you you want to be out there, kick, you're kicking every ball. You remember when you used to play yourself. And, um, you know, unfortunately those days have gone and I've got to try and work as hard as I can to get players in who are going to do better than we've, than we've seen today.